When airlines canceled flights to Mexico because of the swine flu outbreak, it was a major inconvenience and disappointment for hundreds of Canadians, few more so than a Kelowna couple. They didn't just lose out on their warm weather vacation, they lost their wedding day. Blaine Gaffney has the story. So this is my wedding dress that I was going to wear. It's very beautiful, classy, but simple. After many months of planning and preparation, everything was all ready to go. These are the wedding invitations that we printed up for everyone when we got to the resort. But they're no good now. Well, I guess we keep them as a memento. Yeah. <laughs> they're kind of useless. <laughs> so May 4th, uh, the day that we won't be getting married. TJ and Lindsay are not supposed to be at home today. They're supposed to be in Cancun, Mexico, where they were getting married, joined by 50 family and friends. It was the first time a lot of our families were going to be able to meet and relax and vacation together. My brothers were meeting his brothers. Our grandparents were meeting. It was a, it was a really big vacation for us. And, you know, to be told you can't go the day before is very disappointing. They got the phone call from the airline yesterday afternoon. Their charter flight was being cancelled because of the swine flu outbreak in Mexico. We were supposed to fly out at 8.45 this morning and we found out yesterday afternoon, so it was uh, 51 phone calls we had to make. To Disappointing 51 of our closest friends and family the day before we leave. And uh, basically since then we've been on the phone all morning, all last night, with airlines, with our travel agent, with the charter, trying to arrange for us to go elsewhere. Maybe to Cuba or the Dominican Republic, but that'll cost each guest an extra five hundred to one thousand dollars. It's turning into a nightmare. It's it's supposed to be the best time of our lives, and it's been a lot of stress on everybody. So, but they're trying to find the bright side to their quandary. Even if we were down there, I mean, it's Mexico. You have a you know over fifty people. Someone's going to not feel good one day. Well, everyone's going to freak out, thinking they've got the swine flu. You know, so it just it really would have been a dark cloud, guaranteed. So, despite the disappointments and difficulties, the lovebirds are staying positive. Hopefully, we can go to Cuba. It's going to work out. Yeah, It'll work out. Well, I'll be happy. <laughs> but if they can't get to Cuba, they might just get married somewhere <laughs> else. Crazy. Who knows? We might just go down to Vegas and get Elvis Side to marry us in a yeah. chapel. <laughs> In Cologne, Blaine Gaffney, CHBC News. The couple says about half their wedding guests have travel insurance and so can get their trip money refunded. The airline is offering to rebook the vacations for the others for some time between now and October.